Hi Pisces, welcome to your September New Love Tarot Reading. Pisces, this could be someone that you're newly dating, getting to know. It could be some totally new coming into your life. It could be a crush. It could be a friend or somebody you know and now it's turning romantic. It could also could be a missed opportunity from the past as well. So it's not about exes. It's not about uh, someone you've already had a romantic relationship with. So I just want you to keep that in mind. All right, Pisces, we have the crystal angels here. So I'm going to get you some opening messages with this, and then we'll jump into your reading. All right, Pisces, welcome in. I hope you're all doing well, staying safe and healthy at this time. If you are new or returning, welcome in, welcome in, and thank you. My name is Mary. This is Sunlight Inside Tarot. Oh, two, that's too many. I want one more. One more for Pisces. Pisces, September, New Love Tower reading. All right, Pisces, let's see what's going on. Clear negativity. Release negativity from within or around you. Ceremonies and celebrations. It's a time of important life passages such as weddings, birthdays, graduations, or anniversaries. Forgiveness heals. Time to release repressed anger as it's blocking your health and happiness. We got pink there. That definitely gives me new love. And value your self-worth. You are God's, God's precious gem. Diamond and ceremony. Some of you may be going to uh, a function or like a ceremony, like an actual wedding, wedding, anniversary, celebration, function, or something like that coming up soon here with the diamond next to it i'm getting maybe you're going to a wedding or something like that so really pay attention if you're going to any sort of event <laughs> i feel like that's where you're going to meet somebody new i feel like this is somebody new coming into your life um some of you may be actually being set up and going as a guest with somebody and it's kind of like a kind of like a not a date but kind of like a setup like someone to go with and this could actually be the person as well. That makes sense. Um, but there is something here about clearing negativity and forgiving. So if there's anything in your past that you need to, if it's around this event, you know, maybe there's some something around that where, you know, individuals where you've had some tension with, you know, it's about clearing any kind of negativity and forgiving something going into this with a positive mindset because I feel like this is where you're meeting this new person. So that sounds really specific. So please do keep that in mind. And also some of you may be saying, well, I'm not going, you could get an invitation tomorrow <laughs> or somebody may say, Hey, you know, uh, someone's looking for someone to go as a guest with to this, this or that, would you like to go? And it may, it may not even be a ceremony. It could be tickets to a concert. It could be something, an event or something. So please keep that in mind. All right, let's jump into it, Pisces, and see what we have here. I mean, it could be a concert. It could be a sporting event. It could be anything. All right, let us see. All right, Pisces, so we have the Thelema Tarot here. So I'm going to get your uh, reading with this deck, and at the end, we do have magical unicorns, and I'll pull some of those to close it out. All right, so tell me more about this energy for Pisces, September, new love, Tower reading. What do we need to know? For Pisces, please. What do we need to know? Let's see. King of Cups. That's my Pisces card. There you go, Pisces. Three of Cups. Yeah, this is someone you've never dated before. So I don't think you're dating anyone right now. This is someone new coming into your life. Seven of Pentacles. I feel like a lot of planning around this. Something planned that's bringing in new love wow eight of wands taking action travel it could be something around traveling knight of pentacles reverse i feel like this is something that's really going to take off fast knight of pentacles reverse come turns to the fastest night so we're talking about you pisces i feel like this is something new where you haven't even gone on maybe you're being set up on a first date or maybe it's a group date or something like that but there's something being planned where you're going to meet this person and either go with this person or meet this person, whether it's a date, an event, a concert, a, a, I don't know, whatever it is here, something that's planned that's coming up here. 
and it's going to lead to new love. And I see, you know, it could be around traveling to taking action, and it's going to take off very quickly. Hmm, interesting. All right, we've got Pisces and Taurus showing up here. Whatever is being planned, it's telling you to take action on it because it's something that's going to take off quickly. And it's something revolving around you, a plan, or something that's planned. And maybe it could be even that maybe it's not a date. Maybe it's something, because my Three of Cups is like upright courting, dating, getting to know. When it's a reverse, I feel like this is someone you never dated. Um, and maybe it's not really a date being set up, but it's going to lead to new beginning of love here. So whether it's a group event or your, something, maybe you're planning to travel. So real, really pay attention uh, to those energies. All right. Let's see here. I feel like a plan, planning something, you're planning or it involves you, whether it's a date or not, something here is definitely going to lead to meeting a new love. It's going to take off. It could be, like I said, around traveling. And it's going to take off quickly, fast. Fast connection, I feel. All right. Pisces. Okay, tell me more about this for Pisces. September New Love Tarot reading. What else do we need to know? Tell me more about this for Pisces. Tell me more about this for Pisces. My stomach's rolling, so if you hear that, I'm sorry. <laughs> Moon Reverse is saying, no fear that you are again, Pisces. Six of Cups. Hmm. High Priestess. That's you again. I, I feel like it's new. I don't feel like it's someone you already know, though. But we do have the Six of Cups. All right, let's see. Lovers Reverse. Okay, for some of you, it could be someone that you do know, but you're not romantic, never been romantically involved with them. You've never dated them. That could be new love. Four of Cups Reversed. We're going to have to dig deeper here. Two of Wands Reversed. So this is something where... It could be happening right now where there's a decision and making a decision to do something. Like the crossroads is here, I'm making that decision, I made my decision, and this is what I'm doing. A lot of certainty here with the Four of Cups reverse, but then the lovers reversed and the high priest. This is so I feel like this is someone you know now because we have the high priestess reversed and the six of cups. When I get the high priestess upright and like a new love reading, I feel like okay, this is someone that you don't know, you never talked to them before. Um, but when it's in reverse, I feel like this is someone you, maybe you have talked to them before, you kind of know them, somewhat of acquaintance, maybe you know this person through friends. Um, so there's not like a real lot of uh, fear around this. It's like, yeah, okay, I don't know what this means. You're going to have to leave me a comment. Let me know what this means. So there is the energy here of new love, obviously, because we have the Ace of Cups. But it's someone you've never dated before, never been linked to romantically, especially with the lovers reversed, the three of cups reversed. But obviously with the six of cups, it's someone you already know and the high priestess reversed. So there's not a lot of trepidation or fear around this. Like, yeah, okay, that sounds good. But all of a sudden, new love is going to happen. Hmm, interesting. So we got two more cards of Pisces. We have Gemini. All right, I got to dig deeper. What does this mean? What does this mean for Pisces? What are we talking about here? What does this mean for Pisces? I need to know more. It's new love reading for Pisces. And I'm not saying that you never thought about this person in a romantic way, that you were never attracted to them or nothing like that. You've just never been in a relationship with them. You've never been romantically linked with them. I'm not saying you never had those thoughts or like, yeah, that person's kind of cute, you know, or you know, sometimes you can be attracted to someone, think they're cute or handsome or pretty, but it's something that would never, you think at that time would never happen because of maybe other circumstances. I don't feel like it's a missed opportunity either. I'm not feeling that. Some of you are going to be in a wedding party. This person's also going to be in the wedding party. So I do feel like you, you know them, if, even if it's... Uh, briefly or like an acquaintance maybe not a close friend but you do know who they are all right tell me more about this two of swords i don't get any kind of blocked energy around this so there's no hesitation or fear or like oh yeah no no it's like yeah okay you know i don't know what this means seven of cups hmm 
the Empress, the Page of Swords, Death, Page of Cups. This could be somebody that you kind of know through social media with the Page of Swords here. Empress. So there's birthing of something new here. Something seems confusing though. So for some of you, it's like there's a plan or there's something happening where you're like, all right, I'm a little confused, like why I'm asked to go or why I'm a part of this or going with this person or meeting this person or being set up with this. So there's a little, it's like, you know, the person, there's a little confusion as to why you're included or being set up with them or doing something, including you. Oh, I don't know what this means, but the Empress is like, okay, yeah, I feel confident. Also gives birth to something new knowing your value and worth. I feel like you, you know this person through either social media or something like that, but here's a transformation with the death card. So how you know this person now is definitely going to change with the death card here. And then here's some romance stepping in. There's you Pisces. So there's going to be a change here in how you know this person. And now there's some romance stepping in with the Page of Cups. Maybe this person has been interested in you, never said anything. Because the King of Cups can be somebody who kind of keeps feelings and emotions a little covered up. So it could be something now they may feel like this is their opportunity to kind of, uh, I don't want to romance you maybe, or tell you how they feel. Hmm. Libra, Taurus, Scorpio, and Pisces here. All right, we're going to dig deeper because now it's getting interesting. <laughs> All right, Pisces, what else do we need to know about this? Oh, and the Page of Swords can be about truthful communication. Like this person, okay, this is my chance to change everything here by telling Pisces how I feel. So you probably have no clue. I'm, I kind of feel like you have no clue, but you don't have any... Um, like hesitation around it either all right tell me more like tell me more nine of pentacles very single energy here so that's good magician yeah something's manifesting here i feel two single people the energy is about to manifest between you because it is a soulmate connection wow so it's kind of meant to happen this way i see this energy as like the universe okay it's now time to uh, manifest this soulmate energy between these two people. Patience, healing, balance, soul contracts, past life, divine alchemy, things meant to be. It, did I say Knight of Swords is going to take off quickly between the two of you? I think once someone here expresses a romantic interest, then things are going to start. The shift is going to happen between the two of you, and things are going to take off quickly. Five of Pentacles. Ace of Pentacles. Yeah, this person's going to make that grand gesture. And I feel like maybe they tried to show you in the past and maybe you never recognized it. I kind of feel that with the Five of Pentacles. Like, yeah, I tried, you know, little hints there and there to kind of show Pisces I was interested in some way, shape, or form. But I feel like it kind of went unnoticed. They didn't really see it. But now, the, whatever this thing is that's happening or going on or being planned or you're going to or being invited to or whatever... This is this person's chance to make that grand gesture and it's really going to change things and it's going to open your eyes and you're going to see wow i didn't notice that before new beginning right here in the ace of cups sounds kind of specific so it may not resonate for everybody but you know you're gonna have to take it how it resonates because a lot of you may say i don't have nothing maybe like i said you could get up tomorrow go to the mail and you have an invitation to something or you get a message you get a text hey you know and all of a sudden you're invited to something or there's something being planned even if it's just a house party or something like that so let's see we have gemini virgo sag aquarius this is going to be the start start of something uh really stable and grounded here all right We'll do one more row, Pisces, see what else you need to know. We are in Virgo season right now, uh, which we have Gemini Virgo here with the Magician, so definitely could be happening right now. I kind of feel that. 
whatever this is. It's funny, we got the nine and the ace, which is the ten of pentacles, which could be long-term energy here. All right. So what else do we need to know about this? If it is resonating or you're enjoying this, please do like, comment. All the good things be greatly, greatly appreciated. All right. Uh, you know, out of the blue, happening very fast. Like, wow, this is a surprise. All right, let's see. What else do we need to know about Pisces? Page of Wands, exciting. That could be an exciting invitation of some sort or news. Being very excited about it. Queen of Cups, which is going to lead to love. Justice is meant to be this way. Soul contracts, past life. Truth, clarity, justice, balance, getting what we deserve. Could actually be a wedding. I mean, justice can be marriage or commitment. So I feel like this may be an invitation to a wedding. And you may just get it out of the blue. Or maybe someone you know is going to an event, wedding or something. They're like, hey, why don't you come with me? You know, and you may not even know the people. And you're like, well, okay. And you may meet this person there. But yet again, for some of you, I feel like you may you may actually know the person. Like when you get there and like, I don't know anybody. And then you go, oh yeah, I know that person. So it could be something like that too. Five of Cups. Eight of Pentacles. I was just thinking of the Eight of Pentacles and I didn't say it. And now Spirit gave it to me. Um... Because we have the nine and the ace you subtract, that would be the eight, which we have right here. And the two of pentacles. A little bit of being on the fence here. We've got all this pentacle energy. This is the ten of pentacles. I was just talking about that, eight and the two. Long-term energy here starts with that ace, with that romantic gesture. I'm feeling like this person, five of cups, sadness, loss, regret. I just feel like... They feel like they lost their opportunity so many times, either because they felt like you weren't interested or it wasn't noticed. It felt like, oh, it's all up in the air. Maybe I shouldn't even pursue Pisces. I just don't know. Um, but this actually could be something that could work here. Eight of Pentacles. Oh, look at that. We've got the King, Queen of Cups. There's a match here. Falling in love. This person, actually, you're looking at this person, but that person is not seeing that person in that way or recognizing it. But it's all starting with this exciting invitation or something leads to hearts opening up. It's something meant to be with the justice card here or actual wedding or event as well. Let's see uh, what else. Putting in the work, something that actually could work. Page of Pentacles, does that offer a drink, a date, a coffee? King of Wands, someone taking the lead. Some here are definitely going to take the lead. And make that grand offer. Three of Wands happening very soon. King of Swords, truth, clarity, communication. This could be somebody that works in military, law enforcement, education, medical, communications in some way. Four of Pentacles. No more holding back. No more overthinking, just doing. And clarity from Source here with the Ace of Swords. Awakening, epiphany, aha moment, communication, clarity, a new beginning. Yeah, this person's going to seize their chance here. Make that move. Let's see what we got on the bottom. Hierophant. Hmm, someone could be a business owner, entrepreneur, leader. Morals, tradition, values, standards. High level energy here. Someone that believes in morals, traditions, values. That's good. And that actually could be uh, a wedding, too, with the Hierophant. Ten of Swords, though. Knight of Wands. This person felt like m maybe this just isn't meant to be at one point, but they're going to take action anyway with the Knight of Wands. Queen of Pentacles reversed. Hmm. But there is a Two of Cups here. So, yeah, I think they went through a period of not feeling confident. They may have felt like reaching out to you before in some way, maybe social media, whatever. Or through a friend or something it felt like well no you know but here's a chance for the two of cups right there so pisces i think this person is going to make that big grand move so we have a uh, taurus energy here all right so if you're feeling leery about doing something well no i didn't feel like you were though y you might have been like mm, i don't know but then like yeah okay that makes sense okay Boy, that kind of was like beating around the bush through the whole reading, but, you know, it is what it is. Okay. 
I felt like this person maybe kind of beat around the bush to try to show you that they were interested or they liked you and it didn't really didn't really go like how they planned it's like oh yeah I tried to flirt or I tried to show interest but then Pisces didn't really see it so I kind of gave up hope but now there's a chance here where this person is going to ask you show you make that big grand move to ask you out or something like that water well you are water sign Pisces <laughs> maybe they're a water sign too Cancer Scorpio Pisces this could be something happening ar around water too best friends huh maybe some of you are already friends with this person this could be your best friend getting uh, your best friend having an invite or inviting you to something too as well maybe this person is best friends with one of your friends but water is all about healing purging cleansing going with the flow not rushing it's all about feelings love and emotions as well light so yeah i feel like a very light airy energy about this so yeah so this person definitely is going to bring their feelings to light that is for sure and it's okay to be different hmm maybe they're a little bit different than your usual type that could be something too i think how you're going to meet this person is going to be very different circumstances if that makes sense brothers and sisters huh so this could actually be maybe family is someone like a friend of the family as well hmm it could be like one of your siblings saying hey my friend's friend is getting married and i kind of know them and they want me to go you want to come and it's like a little off the cuff and you're like oh, okay i don't really know your friend's friends <laughs> and you're like yeah i'll go so and i do feel like this person does know you some way somehow though as well all right let's all right anyway pisces that's what i have for you um so pay attention to any invitations coming your way or events whatever because this is something that you need to uh do it's going to give this person a chance to really really uh show their interest in you if that makes sense okay pisces that's what i have so i hope that helped that resonate again everything you need to know is down below wishing you the best and i shall see you next time